Madonna's legal team has gone on the offensive as they call the concert delay lawsuit a harassment campaign from fans and maintain that they haven't settled out of court despite a court filing while the judge has sided with them. Just a week after the 65-year-old queen of pop responded to the class action lawsuit, her lawyer has fired back after the plaintiffs in the case had claimed that a settlement had been reached between them. The legal representation for Madonna had asked a judge to strike down a settlement notice that had been filed by Michael Fellows and Jason Alvarez's lawyer from the record which was granted. Her lawyer wanted to make clear that there was no settlement reached in the case, though did admit that talks between the parties had been made. Despite there being communication between the parties towards a settlement, Madonna's attorney slammed the filing as a harassment campaign alleging that it was an effort to get paid. The lawyer, who's representing both Madonna and Live Nation, have rejected settling and seems to indicate that the plaintiffs had jumped the gun when claiming that there was an agreement in place. The judge ultimately took Madonna's legal team's side on Monday as they ruled that there was no settlement that had been struck, thus striking the notice and the case will proceed. According to sources, the plaintiffs now have until July to respond to Madonna's motion to dismiss the case. Just last week, Madonna responded to a class action lawsuit claiming her concert start times are false advertising since she never starts on time.